Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to do the slab of stored cross site scripting into Angular HRF attribute with double quotes HTML encoded. So just enroll this. As we, I will tell you that uh, we in the series of cross site scripting uh, a web suit uh, Web Security Academy. So here we have solved all these labs. Uh, so it's time for this. Let's get started. So here we have uh, this lab contains this one between the comment uh, functionality. So here's a hint uh, to solve this lab. Submit the comment. It calls the alert function. So it's clicked. So they access the lab. So here's the lab. So here we will have comment in the so where is the comment so you will open any post so view post and then uh, go down so here we have a comment so let's type anything let's say hi my name is I am now my name is let's say iron and email would be and let's say this uh, and the website Let me, website must be uh, vulnerable so I will write uh, abc add it xyz okay dot com just post a comment so thank you for a comment let's go back to blog so you can see that your comment is visible over here just go to view page source and go down so you can see your hair your href is in the double quotes okay so we have it it's vulnerable so i will write over here let's again type uh, hi techno and then uh, name would be techno email let's say same and my now type java script and then this alert open close one now so here we have our this symbol i don't know what to call this so you can see that so just post a comment So it's all. Thank you for your comment. Congratulations, you have solved the lab. So this is how you can easily solve these labs. So stay tuned for YouTube channel. I will post daily videos on these labs, and I will cover all these things. So please subscribe and like. Thank you. It's Ayan Ahmed signing off.